want to know how to make this vision board, then you're going to love today's video. By the end of this video, you're going to know how I made this and why I chose a digital vision board instead of a physical one. So stay tuned to the very end of this video. In case you don't know who I am, my name is Shanice Bannis and I am an organizing expert and content creator for my blog, City of Creative Dreams and founder of Inspired by Organizing, which is a custom e-design organizing service. This year, I wanted to try something different. Every year, I hear about someone or see someone talk about a vision board, and although I have loved the idea of it, I never actually took the time to make one for myself until now. Of course, since I wanted to do something different with my vision board because I don't have the space to put one up on my wall. However, I do have a phone wallpaper and desktop wallpaper that I can use for my vision board. So that is what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a digital vision board online. I'm going to switch to my computer screen to show you how I made this. Get a template from Canva. Once you have logged into your Canva account, you can select a blank desktop wallpaper template. If you are doing a phone wallpaper, you can choose that template instead. Search for vision board templates. Select the design tab and use the search box to type in the vision board. This is where you can choose from pre-designed templates. I personally like to choose two or three so I can take what I need from the ones that I like and use them on my version. vision board template. Once you have decided on a template, now you can search for photos that you want to slide into the photo sections. Images and words. In the apps tab section, search for Pexels app. This app allows you to search for photos to use on your vision board. Of course, don't forget to use Pinterest as well. Pinterest has plenty of ideas that you can use for your own board. Remember that you are selecting images and words that align with your goals. Trust your intuition. If something catches your eye, it's meant to be on your vision board. Be open to unexpected finds. Incorporate personal touches to make your vision board uniquely yours. This could include photographs of yourself, notes to yourself, or photos of specific objects that hold sentimental value. A 
of range. Once you have collected the images and the words, arrange them on your template. Move photos and words around and play with different layouts until it feels just right. Display your vision board. When you're satisfied, download the wallpaper image and upload it to the computer's wallpaper image settings area on your device. Your vision board is a visual reminder of your goals. If you're like me, then placing it on your computer screen or your computer wallpaper is the perfect place for you to see it daily. Another place you can put one is on your phone screensaver or any device where you spend a significant amount of time. There you have it. A simple vision board that you can have on the go or on your desktop. Have you made a vision board this year or in the past? I would love to hear if making a vision board has worked for you and what are some things you have put on yours if you are serious about organizing your home don't forget to check my free resources filled with free checklists to help guide you on your organizing journey you can grab it in the link below this video if you know someone who would love this share this did this video help you are you gonna try to make it let me know in the comments below and I will see you in the next video. Bye. Hey, before you go, thanks for watching and get more information at cityofcreativedreams.com. See you there.